Hi everybody, this is Sherry and I just wanted to show you a quick card that I made. Um, the, I used a new stamp that I got from the Not Too Shabby shop and it is called Lucy with, with Cross and I didn't want to do the dark hair so I was worried that it was a little pale but my daughter said she looked like she had been in the sun so I hope that's a good thing and uh because i just was really wanting to go for a real light soft touch and i opted to go with the mint instead of the colors because i was kind of using the uh, package as a reference but i wanted to match this paper which is from stampin up and it's an old set um i know they don't carry it anymore it's called attic let me get that up there attic boutique and I've had it for a long time and this sheet is like my absolute well there's two that are like my absolute favorite and I use these for my tags that I did in a tag swap and I'll be doing a video on that soon and um, and then I used this one and then I use the recollections 110 pound card stock for the card base and it's just a simple five and a half by five and a half inch card I um, didn't want the lady that this is going to is an older lady and she doesn't see real well and a lot of the sentiments I have are just really small so I opted to not I was gonna put a scripture on it but I just I figured it would be too difficult for her to see so I just opted to leave that off and I'll write a nice note on the inside I used uh, my oval spell binders and I believe this is called lacy ovals right here and it's also a spell binders I colored her up with my Copics I used a cross charm from my stash thank you uh, Wally here's some of the seam binding Wally gave me and I made a double bow with the bow maker I'll show you that that my friend made for me and I love it it works great I got another dowel there too but I don't use that one very often so I took it out and it just makes the perfect size bows and then I just ran some ribbon underneath and taped it down and then put the double bow over top and gave it the dove's tail at the bottom and uh, that's it it was just you know the longest part was me battling with trying to figure out which um, you know which colors match this paper because I knew I wanted to use this paper because this lady's very very sweet she doesn't know us doesn't know our church and doesn't isn't even doesn't even go to our church she goes to a different one and we my husband had stopped and asked if he could put up a flyer or a um, a sign in her yard for our vacation Bible school and she was so kind first off she invited him straight into her house and gave him Bibles to pass out to the teens gave him books to pass out to the children that had uh, CDs uh, that went with them and was just the kindest kindest lady and so I really wanted to make her a special card to say thank you and I had been dying to get this so as soon as it came in from Jamie's shop I was I was on it buddy that was the first one I did and I actually got two other stamps from Jamie's shop let me see if I can pull them out real quick I'm knocking everything over I also got um, brain from uh, not the not too shabby shop and I got Sparky and I'm going to use these for projects for my kids as teachers and uh, but that was it it's just real simple and like I said it's blank on the inside so that I can write large and leave a nice note and then there's the charm the cross charm it's got a little rose in the center to mimic the cross that's on the card and then I just got to put my little stamp on the back and it's done. So I hope you guys like it. Let me know what you think. 
Uh, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and leave a comment below. Uh, you know, I love hearing from you guys and f letting me know what you think. If you think, hey, Sherry, you know, you needed to add something else. Or, Sherry, it's fine the way it is. I like, you know, plain and simple. Or, you know, let me know what you like. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you'd like me to try. I'm willing to give anything a shot within reason. And, uh, but I hope you guys like this. Thanks for visiting me today and happy crafting. Bye.